Computer science is not software engineering. A lot of students that go into computer science go in with the wrong expectations. After consuming a ton of popular media, they think that getting a computer science degree will turn them into computer wizards that can build anything, anytime, from scratch. This isn't exactly the case, so let's talk about it. So what's the difference in between computer science and software engineering? Well, in my experience as a computer science student, computer science encompasses a lot more than software engineering because that's not really the focus of the program. The focus of the program is to teach you things like data structures and algorithms, networking, operating systems, systems architecture, AI, machine learning, and foundations for a lot of other cool concepts and things like math. And this depends based on your university. Different universities have different emphasis in their curriculum. And what might be true for my experience, like I just mentioned, might not be true for you. But at the end of the day, it's not about software engineering. You may take a few software engineering classes, one or two, but that really will not be the focus of your degree, at least not for most schools. Software engineering, on the other hand, is more focused with the practical aspects of building software. Crazy, I know. And software engineering, to that end, requires you to learn design patterns, tech stacks, a whole lot of programming languages, getting really good at that, and a whole lot of other skills that may or may not be encompassed in your computer science program. To properly learn software engineering, you're going to need to code outside of class and possibly get an internship or two. Both computer science classes and software engineering as a profession require you to write code, but the nature of that code and the purpose of that code is very different. Think of it as just normal writing. It's a pretty fundamental skill that people in a lot of different fields use. A lot of people write code, but not all of those people are software engineers or computer scientists, and that's perfectly fine because coding is basically a fundamental skill for a lot of different professions, including research scientists. So what actually makes the difference in between code you write for computer science and software engineering? Well, and again, in my limited experience, for computer science classes, you're usually writing code to complete an assignment, pass it, and then pass the class. You may have to be worried about the efficiency of the code and how fast it runs, but you usually won't have to be too worried about how readable the code is or how somebody else could contribute to the project or assignment that you're doing. Whereas when you're working on a software engineering project, you're probably working with a team of people, so you need to worry about how you can read, read and write code that is accessible to everybody else on the team. You need to worry about how your users are gonna be able to using the code and whether the user's data is safe. You need to worry about a lot of different things and concerns that might not be applicable in a computer science assignment. Hopefully that's convinced you that they're actually different things, so now I'm gonna to try to convince you to learn computer science anyways. I'm not saying this to be gatekeepy, and you should take what I have to say with a grain of salt because I'm still just a computer science student and I've only ever been a software engineering intern, but I do think that learning computer science skills has some benefits. In all honesty, you'll probably never have to implement data structures and algorithms from scratch at your front end job where you're writing React code, but I think it is important to be able to know these foundations so you have a solid base to jump from and learn new and different things. Before I started my computer science degree, I was writing the worst possible Python code known to man as a wannabe aspiring data scientist. After I started my degree, I started to learn those foundational skills and I found myself getting better and writing better code that's more optimized, cleaner, and just in general, not a tangled mess of absolute crap. Now, after that, I also gained a lot of confidence in myself to learn new things quickly like frameworks or libraries or new topics. And I'm not saying you can learn a programming language in a week because that's not possible, but I do feel like learning computer science concepts gives you a better understanding of what to jump into and you can learn things quicker. You might listen to this and curse me and say, hey, I don't need to learn computer science. And to that, I would agree. You don't need to, but I think it would be helpful. And remember, when you're studying computer science, don't forget to code on the side. I didn't do much of that for the first half of last year, and I could feel my skills slipping away, but luckily I've gotten back into the group. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, hit that like button, leave a comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Have a great day. Peace out.